The narcissist envy is one defining trait of people with narcissistic personality disorder of which someone would need at least five of the nine criteria. When it comes to envious people in general, they can be some of the most toxic people you can be around as they will rarely to never congratulate other people because they're envious of other people's success. They will often blame others to their failings, to why they haven't achieved something, to why they haven't got something. They will go all out to humiliate those that they are envious of. They're constantly creating competitions for them to win. They're looking to outdo others. They're looking to pull everybody else down, gossip about others. They're looking to make themselves feel better. Now, Envy and jealousy are common emotions. Jealousy is a longing for something or a resentment towards something without malicious intentions. You wouldn't necessarily want to see anything bad happen to another person. Jealousy can just simply be having that sort of protection over your own possessions, over your own rights. You can get jealous of your partner flirting with another, but you don't necessarily want the other person to come to any harm. Envy is a discontentment towards another person's look, qualities or possessions. Envy is where they have those malicious intentions and they seek to destroy for others what they don't have for themselves. Now, low self-esteem can cause that jealousy, it can cause that envy. With a narcissistic individual, their envy means to destroy. They have very little self-esteem as much as they put on that air of confidence and use their charismatic charm to manipulate others. However, when it comes to narcissistic individuals, they tend to believe that everyone has something they don't and they want it no matter what what narcissistic individuals can often be jealous of their own children and this can be several reasons from their children seemingly getting more attention than they are their children's youth now people can be jealous of another person's youth however you wouldn't want to punish that person or take it away from that person a narcissistic individual will take their envy out on their children most people will internalise their jealousy in some way. Narcissistic individuals go all out to sabotage those that they are envious of. Narcissistic individuals tend to believe that everything is a competition for them to win. They go all out to compare themselves to others and they will go all out to compare you to others and get you in a place where you're comparing yourself to others. However, you often internalise it as not being good enough within yourself, that where you get that imposter syndrome. Narcissistic people internalise it as it's somebody else's fault, somebody else is making life hard for them. Narcissistic people often feel very inadequate, they can't sustain that self-worth, so they get it from tearing other people down. Other people that have low self-worth often help themselves by trying to raise other people up. Narcissistic people go for seeking that excessive attention. They create contests to win to combat their inner feelings of shame. They have that self-hatred, they have that bitterness and contempt towards the world around them. They create smear campaigns to destroy those that they are envious of. You cannot help a narcissistic individual. They cannot be fixed with your empathy or your kindness. They just exploit this to their advantage. There's no point in defending yourself to them, they're not interested. There's no point in explaining yourself to them, they're not interested. The key to help you with any sort of feelings of jealousy, to help people with feelings of envy, is self-improvement. As narcissistic individuals rarely to never question what's wrong with themselves, they question those around them, therefore they're not willing to work on themselves and help themselves. They just help themselves to other people's stuff. 
when you question and doubt yourself, you look for ways to improve yourself. You cannot help those who do not see a problem within their own behaviour.